Welcome back to Photography by Harrison. Come along with me as I take a stroll in the rain. We'll see people walking down the rain, walking their dogs, talking, shopping, and we'll also take some pictures of the raindrops. Just yes, this is another tour of my hometown, but you will be surprised. You can walk past the place a hundred times, but if you use your imagination, you can see something different all 100 times. So part of this, of this journey is my imagination, so come along with me and I'll see you on the other side. Are the raindrops holding on to the branch, or is the branch sitting on the raindrops? What about this one? Is the raindrop around the leaf, or is the leaf in the raindrop? Do we walk the dogs, or do the dogs walk us? Reflections in the road. What is it telling us? That is it time to stop in and get some barbecue? It is said, still waters run deep. This water is not still, nor is it deep. A great way to spend time with your friends. A stroll through beautiful downtown Ashbury. If you do not want to take a walk in the rain through downtown, take a slow drive. Whether you are walking or driving, think about stopping in to get your nails and hair done and help out a small business. Do you see just a lamp on the wall? Or do you see a magical raindrop from another world? From a distance, it is just a wet tree with red berries. But up close, the red berries become magical when they're covered in liquid crystal. What is this, you might ask? Could it be the teardrop of a deer? Have you seen the movie, The Ghost in the Rain? There are always supplies you have to pick up when you run a small business. And you don't even mind the rain if you are in Asheville. Look into this reflection, and what do you see? A park bench beckoning you to sit down and enjoy the view. Even the bricks on the sidewalk have a story to tell. Which one have you read? The building in the background and these berries on the tree both have a story to tell. But the berries will tell you theirs first. Can you hear it? I hope you have had as much fun on this tour as I, as I have had, bring it to you. And like I said, don't let the rain keep you from getting out. If the camera's not weather sealed like mine, the FC 300, get you one of those gallon size storage bags. Put your camera in there, cut a hole out in it so your lens can stick to. You can just tape, tape it around your lens and you're good to go. So don't let the rain stop you. And collect, if you like what you see, leave a comment below. And while you're down there, hit the subscribe button, also the notification button. And again, if you like what you see, leave a thumbs up, because that motivates me to go out and do more videos. If you don't like what you see, it's fine to leave a thumbs down, because that will just tell me why, because that will also motivate me to go out and do more videos. So I've said it once, and i said it a thousand times, when it comes to photography, no one knows it all. And the more you learn about photography, the more you learn you didn't know. And again, I want to thank you for coming along with me on this photographic journey, and I will see you next time.